All right, so I listed my dirt bike for sale about two days ago, and uh, honestly, I was flooded with responses. A lot of people, uh, I don't even think they wanted to buy it, they just wanted to say what's up, but. Anyways, I wanted to get rid of this thing and get like a pit bike or something. I don't know, I just feel like I don't, I don't ride this thing to its max capabilities, and it just doesn't make sense for me to have a big 450. Anyways, this morning a guy hit me up and he said he's got this quad. Bro. And uh, no. <laughs> he asked me if I'd be willing to trade, and I was like, no, nah, I'm not trading for a quad, I don't ride quad. And then like, Have I kind to. of started looking at the pictures and it's kind of a nice quad, you know? Yeah, I don't I don't know how nice of a quad it is it's to make you be nice, thinking man. this way, but it's you feel nice. all right? Yeah, I don't know. I looked myself in the mirror earlier. I was like, Are you gonna do this? Honestly though, the quad videos pop, bro. The quad <laughs> that was, videos that pop. That was actually my main thought. I was like, all right, we needed a quad in here, man. This just makes good content. So anyways, yeah, guy's gonna be here in like 30 minutes. We're hopefully just gonna do a clean swap. My CRF 450 for a uh, YZF 450, or YFZ 450. It's only got like 10 hours on it, so it should be nice. It looked really nice. I guess I'm gonna be a four-wheeler guy now. Real quick though, if you don't know the story of how CJ ended up with this bike, we're gonna play a little review flashback and then maybe get the tears going. Maybe CJ's gonna be like regretting this after he sees this, you know? This is gonna be long gone. I'll be crying with my quad. <laughs> <laughs> there she is. We'll start the uh, Craigslist bidding process right now. 2010, super clean, so that's good. We're gonna make the deal. The bike is really, it's in, it's in good shape, it looks good. TJ's gonna freaking love it. It's, it's nice, I, I'd be super happy. Obviously anyone would be. So I don't know, I'm not sure when we're gonna surprise him, but it's coming soon. We, uh, we bought you something. What? <laughs> Bro! <laughs> Shut the f off. Yes, you said yes! it! Yes! Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Dude, my heart's honestly like bumping out of my chest. Man. <laughs> I don't know, man, to be completely honest, off camera. Uh, we can have it on the camera, I guess. Like, ever since Ryan took this thing to wherever that place was you guys went. Gold Creek, Idaho. It, this bike has so never fucked. been the same. Like, I remember hopping on it like two weeks later and I was just gonna take it for a spin. I was like, oh, fuck. And I was like, I took it back and I'd monkey with it and I'd like get it back. I was like, it still ain't right. I mean, it's fine, but it just never felt the same again. Ryan did a dirty number on this bike, not gonna lie. That's what happened when you put a quad guy on a dirt bike in probably the most extreme conditions. There she is, dude. The new hog. <laughs> yeah, pop her open, let's go. We should just easy quad unload it right from the gate. I'm gonna do that when I have this thing. Reverse drop off the back. I was already thinking about it all morning. I was like, man, just think of all the things I can do with this. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> so out of my element. I was raised to be a dirt bike guy. I can't believe this. You know another thing I was thinking about today? It's pretty fing hard to look cool on a quad. <laughs> I mean, it's a quad. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> so you find a quad, so you called in a quad expert. You get one of those. So basically, it's, it's just like yours, but cooler. All right, so we just worked out a deal really off camera, but basically, we're gonna do a wheelie competition. Yeah. And if you out wheelie him, we'll do the trade, but I get 500 bucks on top. And if he out wheelies you, then we're just gonna do the trade even. Okay. I got 500 bucks on you right now, so do not blow this, bro. Okay. I hope my wheels are straight. I know. I got faith in Ryan, dude. I got faith in Ryan. I. It's a frog. Get him out of here. Said he got it, but I got it. Make some money. Yeah, I'm proud of you. Stack it up. Yeah, I'm proud of you. It's a frog. Get him out of here. Said he got it, but I got it. Oh, God damn it. Hey, 
looks like we got a deal, man. <laughs> well, and, sorry, Steve. Lost you 500 bucks there, but... Uh, you let me down as usual. I as should be usual. used to this. <laughs> I should be used to this. You know what? Sometimes you just lose. Who's the real loser here, Ryan? <laughs> Who's the real loser? This kid's shaking hands. <laughs> oh, man. It's not too late, bro. I, Actually, you know what, guys? Hold late. on. Let's turn this around. Let's turn... <laughs> I'm just kidding. Put it in there. <laughs> well, pleasure doing business. Yeah, nice meeting you. You guys said you wanted a tear? I, I got a tear right there. Oh, look at that. Hey, CJ. That shit. Yeah, out here in the woods with your garage, princess. <laughs> I seriously can't say thank you enough. You did not need to do this though. I know man, but I was hoping that well, we did. down the road you guys could maybe just buy me a dirt bike. What's <laughs> up quad guy? I, I call it I prefer to call it a four-wheeler. Oh no. You know, four quad same thing. Is Honestly. that what they call it that? <laughs> anyway, comment down below what you guys want to see me do with this quad. Uh, in the meantime, I'm gonna go take it for a ride. We'll be seeing you. It's a frog, get him out of here. Said he bought it, but I doubt of ya. Make some money, yeah, I'm proud of you. Still learning. Dude, are you okay? I don't know if there's enough room for two quad guys. I guess I'm gonna have to leave. Ryan's like, I don't even mean to like mean for it to be that way. I just think that that's how it is. This is only room for one. Finally, we can make some quad content. Me. <laughs> so uh, obviously, I wasn't prepared. So I don't have an exhaust already here for this thing, but uh, it's way too quiet. So I've been trying to get this baffle out right here for probably like the last hour. Mike has been helping me, and then Mike came up with the idea, dude. Why don't we just drill a hole? through the side of this, hook it to something, and then drive away and it'll pull it right out. So it's either gonna go really well or really good, or but you know, we, we gotta film. Oh, really well or really good. Oh. There's no failing in your right. <laughs> The more I look at this, like the more surprised I'll be if it works. All right, here we go. <laughs> here goes something. Haul ass if you want to, you can. Man, he's in there, boys. I just need to hit it with a little more throttle. It worked! It worked! That sounds real good. It definitely did exactly what I thought was gonna happen and smoked the RS1, but it's okay. But it's okay. Last thing you gotta do is take this, find your nearest garbage can, and throw it away. Because you won't be needing that anymore. So CJ's had his quad for a day now, so it's my turn to teach him how to be a quad guy. Siege, step one of being a quad guy is make sure you always leave your key on. Did you leave your key on? Is uh, your battery no, dead? I did. I'm still learning. It's okay. You'll learn. So you always want to bring in a jumper pack with you so you can jump your dead battery. And there's no kickstart or anything like that on this, so you don't got to worry about that.
riders hate more than some fresh cut grass. There you go. Feel like the last real one stepping. Black on records every session. They won't catch me with the weapon. They won't catch me. You get it? Stepped off for the 747. Still flying. Who would have known you're gonna knock your second uh, quad guy thing out in a matter of minutes here? Oh yeah, that's much better. <laughs> okay, so you, you just got jacked up <laughs> the wheelies now. You just put your foot there. <laughs> you just got the tail light left. And you're a full blown quad guy. Yeah. Thing about having quad, you can take down like most like small to medium sized trees that's if true. you got a good front bumper. Me of right now, Ryan's battery jump pack caddy. Yeah, that's, that's basically all I am here. I'm just running around all the different places that Ryan like kills his quad. Sorry, my bad. Are you okay? Oh my god! Yo, this thing runs like shit. Is that just how they are, or what? <laughs> oh yeah, they just run on like half the power that they're supposed to. Keeps dying. Does it actually? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I got ripped off. What the hell is this? I think you got old. All right. He saw a sucker coming from a mile away. <laughs> I think we're gonna be done with this. He's selling it. What do you think you can trade up to next time? Probably maybe like a three wheeler. I don't know. <laughs> Dude, gonna try all the wheel combinations. You ever seen one of those drag racing lawnmowers? <laughs> I Just, could drive that to work. That'd be amazing, dude. I, it's a frog, get him out of here. Said he bought it, but I doubt it. Make some money, yeah, I'm proud of you. Stack it up, yeah, I'm proud of you. First off, can't ride him on the road, so we're gonna load him up on our trailer. <laughs> <laughs>